The number of people in the U.S. who call themselves multiracial is growing rapidly. Experts who've studied this say that multiracial group can potentially become the majority one. Naomi Ogaldez has more on the story. Wow. This is the Rogers family. Scott and Lena have an interracial marriage. They have two racially mixed kids named Courtney and Josh. But they are not the only ones that have different family backgrounds. My mom is Salvadorian and my dad is black. I'm half Italian and my mom was born in Argentina. I am half Mexican and half German. I am half white, a quarter black and a quarter Fijian. Studies say the mixed race population is growing fast and can potentially become the majority one day. In the 2000 U.S. Census, 6.8 million people said they were multiracial. That number has increased by 32% in the past 10 years. A 2010 Pew Research study says one in every seven new marriages are interracial. Cal State North is sociology lecturer Dr. Christiane Corey says one reason of this increase is caused by the minority population's growth in the United States. We have a lot more people of color living in the United States. And, you know, the more people you have of one race, the more likely they are to mix. Racial categories are starting to break down. In Los Angeles, the demographics has changed within the past 50 years. In the 1960s, whites made up 80 percent and minorities made up 20 percent. But now, the minority population has grown drastically. Hispanics now make up 48 percent. Blacks make up 9% and Asians make up 14%, but that does not include everyone else. Another reason is because people are becoming more tolerant throughout generations. Lena's family wasn't acceptant of Scott when they first found out about their relationship because she was marrying outside her race and religion. Basically, I was disowned. And till this day, I still don't speak to the majority of my family. Despite her family's disapproval, Lena and Scott approve of their kids dating someone from a different race. I'm accepting of them marrying whomever they choose, no matter what country they're from. For their daughter, Courtney, this is a good thing. Yes, I will uh, date outside my race. In Los Angeles, I'm Naomi Ogaldis for Valley View News.